Hi everyone. So my team and I just wrapped up another amazing A-Fest, this time in Mykonos, Greece. Now the question is, what's coming up next? What is this grand theme that we're going to be doing in the Mexican Riviera? That's what I want to share with you next. I'm really excited about this because every now and then I get letters from you guys asking for advice. And one of the biggest pieces of advice you guys ask me through Facebook messages and stuff is this. This is a letter I got this morning. Okay, so there was one of you, a friend who is doing some work in a political party in your home country, and you're trying to reveal corruption that's happening. But the people who are corrupt are attacking this person. And so this person is going through extreme levels of anxiety and stress, wondering if this mission that they are on is really worth it because the burden that they are facing is so strong. Many of you have felt this stuff. There's some great thing that you want to do in the world, but it sometimes seems as if odds are against you. It sometimes seems as if you have to go through all of these ridiculous hurdles that you have to sacrifice your health, your well-being, your happiness, the well-being of your family to pull off this mission. This is what we're going to tackle in this upcoming A-Fest. This upcoming A-Fest is going to be based on a key idea in my book. That is the idea from chapter 10, Finding Your Quest. A-Fest Cancun is going to expose you to a number of really extraordinary teachers who are going to show you how to develop a really rock solid sense of inner power and how to then use this inner power to discover why you're here, to discover what it is that you should be doing in life. So many of us get trapped into the wrong careers, the wrong businesses, get trapped with the wrong people. You're going to learn tools to realign. See, one of the biggest mistakes people make when they are pursuing a goal is that before they chase the goal, they don't check to see if this goal is really the right thing they should be facing. So AFES, Live Your Quest, is going to show you how to get alignment, how to understand why you're here, what is it that you're meant to be doing, how can you best make a dent on the universe, and then it's going to teach you tools to accelerate your life forward towards those goals. Now as you do that, you find that you're going to have to go through accelerated rates of conscious awakening. At this AFES, we'll be exploring an idea on expanding consciousness and you're going to learn how to up-level your level of consciousness from level 1, 2, and 3 to eventually level 4. Level 4 consciousness is when you're truly making an impact on the world. It's when you're really embracing that role as a leader or a visionary that you were born to do. Now, as you start pursuing these bigger goals, as you try to make an impact, one of the biggest things that happen is that you are going to hit walls. You are going to experience failure. We'll be exploring a concept from Michael Beckwith, Kensho and Satori. These ideas will teach you how to adopt the philosophy that many Zen practitioners, that philosophers like Alan Watts suggest, that teach you how to not just be immune to failure, but to see failure as learning experiences. This is one of the key ideas which I talk about in my book and one of the most dramatic philosophies that have had an influence on my life. It gives you the fuel and the boldness to do truly scary big things. Finally, we're going to explore the new spirituality of humanism. We're going to share ideas such as the Godical Theory, which talk about how we are all connected. And you're going to learn how the ultimate quest we all have is to push humanity forward, to leave the planet better off for our children than it is when we inherited it. And this idea is so powerful to me because this really is the core of our tribe. It's what makes us who we are. We're going to explore this idea and teach you how to take this philosophy and bring it to your external tribes, your communities, your groups, your companies outside AFES so that you can help other people elevate their level of conscious awakening and, in a way, help move the world forward. So we upgrade every AFES. Greece was already APES number 10 and probably the best APES we've ever had based on the feedback we're getting. Cancun is going to be no different. So if you're interested in attending, go ahead, click on the link below to learn about how you can get your application in and get a ticket for this upcoming APES. If you have any comments, comment in the video below and I'll be happy to answer your questions as will my team. Thank you.